This is a real American car, spacious, practical, unpretentious, and durable. Car for all occasions. And although it is simple in design, it is easy to maintain, and also simple and affordable for repair. Those who have operated an American car for at least some time, as a rule, then get hooked on the Americans tightly, or certainly not remain indifferent to them. These cars, as they say, are made for people and have a special charisma. One of them is the Chevrolet Trailblazer. An impressive and brutal SUV was sold new for less than $40,000. Who else among the German classmates can boast of such a price tag? And the second-hand ones are more attracted by the cost. In addition to the five-seat version, the EXT version was offered with a wheelbase extended by 400 millimeters. For seven seats, the standard engine is a 4.2-liter or 6 petrol, 273 horsepower, and a 5.3-liter V8, 294 horsepower. Since 2005, the power of the engines has increased to 295 and 305 horsepower, respectively. The gearbox is a 4-speed automatic, although the base was a 5-speed manual. But there are no versions with mechanics on the secondary market. Russian dealers sold the Trailblazer only with the R6 engine and in a 5-seater version. The car does not stand out for the quality of the interior decoration, the plastic of the front panel is cheap and hard. But the equipment is initially generous. The base LT had ABS, an automatic, for airbags, alloy wheels, air conditioning, an audio system, and full power accessories, including seats. More common is the Trailblazer in the LTZ version, which complements the base electric sunroof, servos, and heated seats, as well as leather interior and climate control instead of air conditioning. The main recommendation when buying a secondhand Trailblazer is a complete diagnosis. Otherwise, the entire burden of expenses will then fall on your shoulders. And so the car as a whole is reliable. Engines are durable thanks to the chain drive of the gas distribution mechanism. They were originally designed for gasoline with an octane rating of 91. However, our fuel is not always tough for American engines. Most often, spark plugs fail due to bad gasoline. If you are very unlucky, then with them you will have to change a jam fuel pump for 12,500 rubles. It is also recommended to clean the injection nozzles at least once a year. The AutoTrack all-wheel drive system has four modes, two high, rear-wheel drive, auto 4WD, automatic, permanent all-wheel drive four high and four low with a reduction gear. In the front gearbox, after three to four years, the oil seal begins to flow. Replacement will cost 3,000 rubles. The same thing happens in the transfer case. Repair costs the same, about 3,000 rubles. The front suspension is independent, and the rear is a rigid bridge suspended on springs. Chassis durability is directly related to driving style. Weak points are the rail and ball joints. Body. Do not rush to sound the alarm if the gaps of the Trailblazer body panels seem too wide and uneven to you. This is not a consequence of artisanal repairs, but simply an innate feature of the machine. The rear axle can be killed by illiterate operation, periodically clean the breather tube. The shank, from 9,800 rubles, of the cardan shaft breaks from fast driving through the pits. Breakdowns in electrical equipment are common, but their repair is inexpensive. Light bulbs of illumination of devices, dimensions and stops burn. Regular optics are not effective. The front gearbox does not tolerate barbaric treatment. Driving on asphalt in 4HJ mode leads to expensive repairs. Suspension bearing and cross pieces serve 100,000 kilometers. Engines are unpretentious, but by 100,000 kilometers, you usually have to change the pump from 2,300 rubles and the drive belt tensioner pulley from 1,850 rubles. The fuel level sensor fails. R6 is voracious, but its appetite directly depends on the driving style. The 4L60E automatic transmission has a simple design and excellent maintainability. The main thing is input diagnostics and proper operation, otherwise repairs, from 55,000 rubles. In the front suspension, the weak points are the lower ball joints, 2,150 rubles, steering rods, and the rail itself, 26,000 rubles, which are being repaired, or 13,500 rubles, but it still won't last long. 